Cancer is a disease in which cells divide uncontrollably. Over the past 30 years, detailed studies have shown that genes, such as tumor suppressor genes, are often destroyed by DNA mutations, allowing cancer cells to grow. In recent studies of certain breast cancers, it has been observed that parts of the DNA that control tumor suppressor genes are frequent targets of cancer mutations. First, let's explore a normal cell, which is not dividing. Inside the nucleus of the cell, transcription factors are constantly scanning the DNA for their binding sites. The transcription factor moves along the double helix until it encounters a place where the nucleotide pattern is in the exact sequence for it to stick. Once the exact sequence is found, the transcription factor changes shape and binds tightly to the DNA. This binding allows the important tumor suppressor gene to be expressed. Many proteins then stick to the transcription factor and form a protein machine to make RNA for the tumor suppressor gene. This production prevents the cell from dividing. Now let's explore a cancer cell. Like all cancer cells, this cell divides when it is not supposed to. Inside the nucleus, the transcription factor searches the DNA for its binding site. Different types of cancer have unique mutations. In this specific type of breast cancer, the binding site has been mutated. The altered nucleotide pattern is not recognized by the transcription factor. It passes by without sticking. Without the transcription factor binding, the gene stays inactive and the critical tumor suppressor gene is not expressed. The cancer cells continue to divide without control. Over time, more mutations accumulate, causing the cancer to grow faster and faster.